Alpha 18, and I will clear arrivals up to Alpha 12 and hand them off to you before that. Right to that, no worries. We've got our first flight of the day. Good uh, good evening, everybody. My name is Biscuit. I'm here with our Brad. Welcome to um, ATC. I was going to actually say Microsoft Flight Simulator, but it's not. It's uh, Welcome to Edinburgh. And we're going to take our first. We've got Airbus, Airbus Industries. That's a very interesting one. And he is doing VFR circuits today, and he will be. Oh, we'll go, this one's going to get handed off to Brad very shortly, and I'll just uh, call in um, GMP Air. Hang on, he's put on his flight pan VFR circuit. Yeah. Check your flight plan. Says VFR. <laughs> yeah, imagine that. Um, it shows us an F forty as well, so that's a bit unusual, isn't it? So, uh, <laughs> so hang on, I need to get uh, five out pilot call. Oh shit, hang on, I need to disconnect and reconnect. I didn't do uh, art face. No, what is all? Apologize to the viewers that are just saying he's a bit of sweating, but that's okay. Connect to art face. Yeah, he didn't mean it really. He and just uh, he just felt it just something land his toe. I went, ah! Okay, Amy, best friends, one three four two. Hello. Yeah, well, I can Airbus stream one tango part. Stand oh. one alpha request and I for yeah, circuit clearance. I for circuit. Airbus industry. Airbus industries. Uh, stand by for your clearance. Number one. Yeah, the tower view is going to be absolutely fine, uh, so we'll get that. Um, Stand by, number one, Airbus, one tango. I can... We're going to have to get... If you give me, if you, yeah, if you give me the royal, I can stream it in the Discord for you. Uh, oh, yes, that's right. You need to... Ah, damn, it wouldn't work. Right, okay. It's okay. The, um, not to worry, not to worry. It's fine. Uh, IFR CCTS PH. And I uh, will have to get my local score up. 0430, I think. Well, that'll do. Yep, yep. Right, so Brad, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, this Airbus Industries is looking for IFR, so we'll just get him up to altitude 4,000 feet, uh, departing from Rumi uh, 24. So, um, well, here we go, we'll, we'll try this. Airbus Industries, you ready to copy your clearance? Ready to copy Airbus 1 Tango. Airbus Industries, you are cleared for IFR circuits, uh, not above altitude 4,000 feet. QNH 1023, squawk 0430. Can't really, no radar. Cleared so. for IFR circuits, not yeah, above 4,000 feet. QNH 1023, squawk 0430. I think Commerce said Carrier it was interested in doing it last week, but I don't Airbus know. Airbus Industries, that. we back, correct. Can't even see industries properly. It's so terrible. It's uh, yeah. I get. I, I didn't know what kind of clearance to give them because we know. Airbus one so. tango stand one alpha ready for push and start. Airbus industries from stand one alpha push and start is approved. Can you push straight into stand one zero zero for me? Push and start approved. Push straight into stand one zero zero. Uh, stand by on that. Yeah, because um, he's going to end up bashing the back of his plane at something if I get him to face north. Airbus yeah. 1 yeah. Tango, we can push yeah, into stand 100. Roger, straight push is approved. Straight push approved, Airbus 1 Tango. Yeah. <sighs> Quite an interesting Airbus Industries. Um... Yeah, that's such a long call sign. Yeah. <laughs> I might just abbreviate it to Airbus 1 Tango. I'm not gonna lie, I can't be bothered oh, with Airbus Oh, it's Airbus One Tango, right, ah, uh, crap, didn't see that bit, right, okay. Oh, of course, of oh, course. Airbus One Tango will definitely be better. Ah, uh, do you know what? Not a good start for me. Get this call sign wrong. <laughs> but it's gonna be easy to say, Airbus One T. Reminds me of my uh, school classroom when it's in first year. One T, that's my class. Right, we may have a radar controller in a little bit. Oh, that would be absolutely fantastic. Who would that be? Uh, Connor. Fantastic. Oh, tell see Connor if you're watching this, you're out of my. Hold on, I'll be right back. I left my drink in the kit. Bridget. Airbus Alright. Welcome back. 
Yeah, I forgot Connor has, has, has an ADC. So that's very yeah, handy. he's a he's yeah. a he's a good he's a good controller as well. So. Oh, he's amazing. Yeah, he's just uh, yeah, uh, but don't tell Daniel he can tell us. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> well, especially don't tell Paul. He'll he's a good Edinburgh Raider. Daniel's a brilliant Heathrow. Daniel's a brilliant Heathrow director. Yeah, definitely. And I'm a very good wet controller. <laughs> oh, yeah. I got I got Bournemouth covered. Yes. <laughs> Non-standard departures and that. Yeah. Now we should do something at Bournemouth soon. We'll uh right. try and speak to Squawk about it on a day that I'm available. Do like a Bournemouth event or something. I don't know. That's a good plan. And hopefully we'll hopefully get a few people in. Yeah. Yeah. So that would be nice. Airbus One Tango ready for taxi. Airbus One Tango, taxi holding point Delta One, runway 24, via Echo and Alpha. QNH 1023. Holding point Delta One, Echo, Alpha, QNH 1023, Airbus One Tango. Lovely. Now he's on the move. I've got a broadcast. Uh, somebody's taking an APC exam at uh, Denver. Oh, lovely. They must have it so easy there when they have exams. Like Yeah, there's never anyone on. <laughs> NA gets zero traffic on either. Yeah. Uh, think about playing for Guessy to see for JFK. At mm -hmm. some point. But I don't know. Well I kinda wanna uh, do try some Oceanic as well. Amsterdam would be fun. Oh god, I yeah, definitely. Or like any of those airports in Germany that just get like ridiculous amounts of traffic. Frankfurt. Mm. <laughs> that place never shuts. Uh, Frankfurt, Hamburg. So much traffic. Yeah. Oh, EDDP towers on, so we could have had control for the uh, target. Mm. EDDP tower that's on. That's great. A while since we've seen the unusual ATC controls come on, like uh, North Korea. You know, so. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> Tower view is working. Ah, you're all set. Fantastic. My little red arrow down there at 1B. <laughs> uh, it just yeah. looks so out of place there. I've just parked it there, so it's, if, if I accidentally reset my camera view, I'm not too far away to get the, the uh, tower view back up. You should just park your plane on top of your tower. Uh, to, <laughs> I don't, to be honest, in slow mode, I don't know how to go up or down, but I think I tried it before and um, it just like it fell through the tower and then like bounced off the grounds and then the uh, engines turned on. So. Oh, oh, that was amazing. Yeah, I think our for our just. Oh, you mean slew the plane? Uh, yeah. Uh, uh. Yeah. So the tower's not like modelled for it. Like it's not. You can just go th straight through it. Yeah. Oh, personally, I would have parked it behind stand three one six, like the old the old Emma runway that's not in use anymore. It's... Yeah. The trouble with that is if I if I accidentally click five and reset my camera view, then I've got yeah. so far to go to put it back up oh, onto oh, the yeah, tower. So I've got my little red arrow down on one B. Yeah. Anyway. Absolutely. So um. So, oh, viewers are start <coughs> excuse me, viewers starting to pick up a little bit. So, hello for those that just joined. Welcome to Edinburgh Airport. I am your ground control today with our tower brads. Good evening, everybody. I hope you're enjoying your evening. We're uh, just the uh, sort as Airbus Industries one tango. He is going to be performing as IFRs, and we're hoping for a radar controller to jump on shortly. Do you want me to um, push to mute or not? No, no, you're absolutely fine. Um, I've normally got it on my default just so you don't have to hear me. Oh, oh absolutely, but... yeah. Oh, it's ab absolutely fine. I suppose when it's busy, but I think it'll be absolutely fine. Yeah. Zoom in down that taxiway. Yeah, speeding. Yeah, I'm sure you've got to have words with him. Let's copy our phone number. Yeah, cheeky, cheeky, cheeky. He's an absolute cheeky, <laughs> cheeky, speedy bugger. So, uh, oh, don't forget your little uh, your little white microphone thing at the top of. Uh... Oh, why? 
in there. It's on there, there we go. Airbus One Tango, contact Emperor Tower 118, decimal 705. Enjoy your IFR circuit. Season. 118, 705, thank you for the Airbus One Tango. Yeah, I'm a circle, things working indeed. Yes. So, yes indeed, it's good. It's gonna be a good day. Ah. <clears throat> Our controller, our tower controller, should be back with us shortly while he sorts out the uh, the Airbus Industries flight. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. It's such a, a long call sign. I'm just I'm just abbreviating it to Airbus. I'm not. Yeah, I know. Bugger it. Yeah, I know. We'll have to break the rules a little bit just because of that call sign. <laughs> We oh no I thought I thought we really came online but it no it's somebody else for France so that's a bit of a bummer there. Yeah, at least he's up to his flight plan, so he's uh, going to touch goals at Glasgow as well. So that's gonna be interesting. Yeah. And. Uh, and off he goes, I think, yes. Did, did he remember to fill up? Oh, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> He's rolling. Yeah. Oh, I love having the tower view. Such a nice little feature. It's nice, I Yeah, I know I get a good view of everything. Maybe the four foot bridges as well. Uh, yep. I can just about see the top of the uh, rail bridge. Oh, uh, I can see all of them, yeah. Just all of them, yeah. Fantastic. He's put his gear up about 10 feet above the runway. <laughs> <laughs> well, I would zoom it, but I'm on the ground, so I won't be able to see him that far. So, <clears throat> so I'll just have to get the screen as it is. So, anyone watching, please feel free to jump in, leave your comments on the, on the chat box, and uh, I'll be happy to read them back. So, uh, I'd like to say, always love to say hello and uh, discuss what we need, whatever you would like. I don't know, just uh, try and keep some form of entertainment going on this evening. <laughs> Otherwise, we'll just be talking about that Airbus industry is like, so it's been doing interesting things. <laughs> oh, do you recognise this sound? Oh, I am brew. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> that, yeah, yeah I, 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 I don't know. It's a Scottish thing. We can tell which can's been opened, but it's definitely not a tennis <laughs> lager. So. <laughs> Absolutely lovely. Oh, he's speeding. 280 knots. 280 knots? Oh. 300 knots. What's his altitude doing now? Thousand feet, <laughs> three hundred and twenty knots. <laughs> Guy's still in full toga. He's really wrecking that airbus today. Well, <laughs> <laughs> deviation for sure. Ah, uh, yeah, speeding it. Just notice you don't use the little drop down thing to see who's in your fruit. Um, funny enough, I actually have it dropped down just now. It's uh, not shown on the Twitch, but it's definitely shown oh, on my screen. Okay. Yeah, so oh, okay. I think it's because yeah. under a separate window. I think your 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 stream is just streaming like Aurora, not your screen. It's, yeah, well, actually, the way I've got it set is basically I'm streaming the main Aurora and the have the traffic manager and part partially the VHF bit as well, uh, which is oh, kind of nice to set up. So. It's my screen yeah. looks totally different. Well, I've got it super wide and everything's all in a different place. But on Twitch, yeah, yeah completely different. It's amazing. So that uh, you can mod modify your settings that way, and I can still have the w have things the way I like it to on my screen. So yeah, yeah, very clever stuff. Yeah, once I get my internet sort of improved, I'll probably stream as well, ah, and then I can nice. have like power view and everything up and all that good stuff. Make it look absolutely pretty. Yes, absolutely.
Well, we're 15 minutes in. We're in our first first quarter of the hour, so we'll be on. But total time of our ATC is two hours tonight, and then after that, we'll be handing the keys over to our Discord member Caden, and uh, he will be taking your clearances later on this evening. We do have an inbound that is A320 coming from Barnett's, wherever that is. Oh, I wonder if he'll make it on time before you Swiss Air. Swiss Air? Ah. And it will... ATC message. WR. Uh, uh, it's just Swiss. Just Swiss in there. Well, well, it is a bit quiet tonight, isn't it? Well, it's yeah. Shame. To be last, fair, though, yeah. like, last week started off quiet, and then like forty-five minutes into the session, we had like ten outbounds, eleven inbounds. Yeah, it was like the busiest that anyone's ever seen Edinburgh. <laughs> that was mental high. It's really glad that happened. Yeah, it was good. That was yeah. a good session. Let's see what we got tonight. Right. His circuits aren't looking as uh, nice as mine were the other day on the web by. Yes, I. It's uh. Yeah, no, you seem to see. Uh, you, yeah, you seem to keep your circuits nice and tidy, very tidy. Yeah, yeah. Well, I, I just, I do it all in like with like timing. So I take off, and then once I, once I pass, as like I think once I get to like four thousand feet, I turn. Yeah. Turn left to one five zero, wait sixty seconds, and then I turn zero six zero, so I'm on downwind. Mm. Yeah, it's. And, uh... and then I pretty much put in just to into the MCDU. I just go direct to the. Uh, I think it's like CI08 or whatever it is, that waypoint. Yeah, the Obers would ruin it. <laughs> it's just to track yeah. your, path, your path and that's it. It's like, oh, a lovely wee rectangle shape there, and then not obviously would kill it. Yeah. Well, no, the, the orb because I, when I was in your your uh, ADC session, and we had like a, like a, it was like a 15, 16 knot, sort of almost crosswind. Mm. So I was doing my orbits, and I was orbiting like, Literally just at the end of the downwind on runway two four, and by the time I finished my orbits, I was almost at like Kakaldi. Like it was Kakaldi. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so the wind was just pushing me over, and I know it wasn't me because I had my wings at like the exact same angle every time. It was just like when I was on like that certain bit, the wind was just throwing me further and further away from the airport. <sighs> oh no, I do like. Apparently he's still doing 343 knots. 430 knots, you're saying? Uh, yeah, 300. Oh, he's doing 330 knots. Oh, 330. It's just pretty much. Well, he's just turning base now. At Glasgow, he's, yeah. He's really. Didn't take no, long to get to Glasgow. He's coming. No, he's not at Glasgow. He's coming back. He's, he's here. Is he? Oh, right. I can't see anything because I'm ground. Yeah. No, he's just turning now. Uh, about 13 mile final. Well. We... Yeah, radar's on. Radar's on. Nice. Yeah. Fantastic. <laughs> well, you go, Connor. Way to go. Incoming chat message. That reminds me, I need to turn down uh, that, I believe. Lovely. I think doing it again. Sorry. Information Delta. H1023. <laughs> no view. Yeah. How you going on, Connor? 2 4. I don't know what it's doing. Incoming chat message. I don't know what the aircraft's doing. I don't want to know what the aircraft's doing. In ATC coordination where you need me, yep. 
I wanna hang on, how do I uh I bow Aurora? There's a command I can do to add us both into a chat, like in, in Aurora, and put me and you in. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, let's let's do that, yeah. Slash A, I don't know what it is. Oh wait, did we pull the wrong corner then? Sorry. Yeah, it's yeah. a different corner. Alright, oh, I'm sorry. Connor, I've got to put you back the camera on. I'm sorry. Okay, <laughs> See you in a bit. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> He's not, he's not ADC. Did you, it's the coordination we need me, uh... Yeah, he's in the main eye about us. Alright. And, the uh, Caden's just... Oh, it's dot, hang on. So, dot A. Yeah. E G P H underscore N D. There we go. Incoming chat message. Incoming chat message. Yeah, perfect. That's working, I think. I don't think it's worth it. It's not supposed to show both of us. Have, have you got it working? Oh, uh, there we go. Yeah. Wait, what do you mean? Uh, hang on. I've, I've got I've got all, all three of us in a in a private message chat on a roll. Oh, it's a short one for you. Right, it's not a short for me though. Yeah. Uh, just type in type in dot a like click click on him and then type in dot a space pgph underscore tower and then you should have all three of us. Got it. Good evening, Good evening, Good evening. How you got on? Yeah. Thank you for joining us. Um, uh, this is absolutely amazing. Thank you. Thank you for opening it with that as well. Uh, we just I'm sorry. yeah, just wondered what uh, what's been happening so far. So um, I'll uh, quickly introduce Jusha. Uh, so um, and everyone that's uh, watching on the stream, we have our awesome radar controller online today so and oh, we've we got, we got too many corners so it's another sure. corner so yeah we're, we're building <laughs> the wrong corner so uh right yeah i put in the atis that you're streaming because i think technically we're supposed to yeah yeah good idea yeah um do you want to put my uh, twitch channel name or something would that work for um i don't know if you're allowed to do that uh no not the atis no um not that I know of anyways, but, uh, yeah. Well, let's hope it's a bit wee busy night for us tonight, so fingers crossed. So. Do we lose the Airbus Industries completely? Yeah, I'm, I messaged him to see where he went. I don't know if he... I'm just gonna assume that he uh, he didn't make it. SW controller, he good just, evening. Just turned on final. Yeah. Good evening to the SW controller. I uh, was just sending a message on the Twitch chat. Um, SW, what would? Um, aha, it's really oh, it's yourself. Aha, lovely. What does SW stand for? What? Southwest. Oh, so uh, that, it's pretty much. Uh, Exactly as it says in the tin. <laughs> so, absolutely lovely. And thank you, <laughs> SW Controller. Thank you for the follow. Uh, makes me feel so happy. So thank you very much for that. That's. Uh, quite amazing welcome welcome on board and uh, i hope to bring you 
some sort of amazing content. Uh, <laughs> so I'm just, but no, I'm just a rookie. So, uh, but yeah, thank you for the follow, and uh, hope you enjoy a wee session. Um, somebody said, I think it was you, Brad, and that my voice just helps relax people. I don't know um, if it was you that said that. No, it was Caden, I think it was, wasn't it? Caden uh, or Andrew? Uh, Andrew. Or Maybe an Andrew, I'm not sure. It says, uh, when I just speak like this, or just speak normally, or say anything that comes out of my mouth, it seems to relax people. I don't know. Nobody... Connor, are, you, uh, are, you, are you based in Southwest, are you? Sure about that, yeah, I am. Yeah, very nice. I literally just had a typhoon fly over the top of my house like half an hour ago. It scared the life out of me. <laughs> <laughs> just getting done with the Bourm with the Bournemouth Air Show. It, uh, Caden looked on like a flight radar. It was like 500 feet above my house. Yeah, that, I don't know. It was that loud that I'd even heard it through his mic as well. It was that loud. I thought it was a, <laughs> I thought it was a missile strike or something like that. It was happening there. It was like, it was so loud. Did you, did you? Did anyone's windows break? I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> oh, it's that was quite quite scary. Yeah. Well, coming up to. Happen nearly half past so hopefully in the next 15 minutes we'll start seeing some sort of traffic coming out so fingers crossed yeah well it was it did get really busy last week yeah I don't know where, uh, wait, put it in put it in the announcement oh do I you already did can stick a dollar with oh, um, I think yeah I'll just say it's fully staffed now with radar as well yeah I'll go for it should let you should let you do it I think hopefully uh, I don't can't put in announcements. Ah, damn it! I don't have the events role. Let me just. Uh... Oh, of course it's about I want on ETC. That's why. Ah, I see. Two seconds. Let me see if I can. Do, 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 do. I'll stick it in the lobby. Uh, well, our inbound has just taken off. He is due in just over an hour. Well, I'm Brad and at. gone. There we are. Hopefully that'll uh, tag us up, but I don't know, but we'll see. Ah. Oh, thank you very much, dear. Ah, that's just, uh, oh, that is lovely. I like Lithuanian food. You still with us, Connor, or did your Aurora crash? Thank you. <sighs> Half an hour in, that's me on my tea break already. No, I just I just drink loads. I tried to like <laughs> stop my throat from going dry, and then I drink like. Oh yeah. Oh, oh. oh I wonder if his internet went. Oh no. Disappeared off of radar, them. and then uh, 
didn't say anything for a bit and then dis uh, disconnected on Discord, so I wonder if his internet went down. He'll be skidding at the moment. Yep. <laughs> oh, yeah. <clears throat> hello, hello. Ah, hello. Welcome Let me just restart my computer. Ah. Well, it's good to have you back. Now, I thought I thought it was something may have happened, something. like a Windows update or something. I don't know. It's like inconveniently forcing it to wear. Caden comes back. Hopefully, hopefully. Okay, radar's back online now. Roger on the radar. Oh, and uh, on the on the substar radar, if I get an IFR clearance, uh, what is your instructions? I'll work on that and let you know. Oh, Roger that. No worries. No rush at all. You're absolutely fine. <laughs> now we we had one that last flight we took off, and that it was IFR circuits, and yeah, we totally it just disappeared. I don't know what's happened to. Him. Yeah, he was just coming on to the ILS as I disconnected. Ah. Just like think this is Sunday service today at Edinburgh right now. It's uh, not many planes, but hopefully that will change. Fingers crossed. Got information box drop. Don't see much of a change on the air set, I think. Uh, Caden said he is coming back. His computer was blowing up. Ah, uh, I see. Oh, I have an observer on with me, and uh, yes. Oh, he's back and he's on fire now. My goodness. Incoming chat message. Right, I've got the um, information we need for an IFR departure clearance, so I'm sorting that. Thank you, Connor, for that. That's alright, no worries.
My mind has gone absolutely blank. What's the button to bring down all the options from the top of the screen on Aurora? Right click. Uh, right click and do reference bar. Yeah. And menu bar, depending which options you want. Sure, thanks. That's no problem. I get it all the time. Yep. I think my mind's just old. <laughs> What's the chances of, uh, of uh, this aircraft going to Dunagora? <laughs> well, it is a bit high, but... The only on touching goes, oh, it doesn't... Oh, I see him there. There we go. Very fast for a five mile final. Right. <coughs> it must have been that way, 230 knots. Yeah. Fred. It's got a bit of a. 4 DME. <laughs> <laughs> Go on, I knew it. I absolutely knew it. I <laughs> know <laughs> oh, he was doing a touch and go. Oh, is it touch and go? Alright. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, that'll explain why he's going to come in so fast. I guess we'll see him later. Just zoomed in and zoomed it. Lovely.
be advised, be advised. Airbus One Tango Pam Pam. Roger on the Pam Pam. something to do with him doing 350 knots. Yep. Guarantee. <laughs> He's stuck on toga. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yep, I knew it was I knew it was done before he even called for taxi. <laughs> Just to let you know, reason for pan is a low fuel warning. Roger. Did, did, I, did I not mention about that aileron when he took off and that? So I hope he's got fuel. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, you, wow. you did. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. I've, I'm, so, I'm so predictable today. <laughs> well, no other aircraft on the ground or in the area, so all his. Yeah, all good. I'm sure while he's on his pan pan, we can all have a sip and relax and have a cup of tea. Rival's just leaving Norway now. Mm -hmm. Norway, love the place. Yeah, I'd love to go there. This is from uh, Amy, best friends, 1342. Hey, Paul, came on Edinburgh for observing, and I'm on your frequency. Thank you for tuning into my frequency. I will see if we can get some use of this frequency so not to worry. <laughs> uh, oh I've lost the lost the plane. What a username that is. Uh AS OBS. <laughs> yes, that's yeah. First initial sign initial <laughs> OBS. Oh, quite right. Proper call sign for observing. I'm on about the <laughs> Amy underscore best friends. <laughs> oh oh yes yeah, uh, it's quite cute. Yeah. I think it's a cute girly <laughs> thing for for girls. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> and also, Amy Best Friend, she is also our Edinburgh Tower Controller as well. She's been really, really good at it. And, uh... It's always fun when there's a girl in a tower. 
she does attract a lot of traffic. I don't know how she does that. She, she, she just logs in and there we are. Traffic just starts appearing. All stations at Edinburgh, closed traffic, uh, Mayday in progress. Oh, oh dear, Mayday, right. Roger. Uh, looks like I will we'll not be given any de departure clearance just now. Uh, you can dispatch the, the virtual fire services. Roger that. Um, I will do it. Um, uh, Truck leader, truck one, truck two, uh, I need you on the standby for an emergency inbound. Right, okay, I've got emergency, emergency trucks uh, holding just between Alpha 10, Alpha 11. Okay. Fire controls requesting the nature of the emergency. I think he said it was just low fuel, innit? Yeah. I think it will be. Hi. <laughs> Amy says, that, think when boys come on EGPH, they get no traffic, but when I'm on, I do. Yes. When it's, yeah, it's when it's girly ATC controls. Yep, yeah, it does attract a lot of attention. It's a good thing. We could, we do need to get some more girls on uh, the IBAO network as well. Be, be kind of nice. Try get, try get more. To, try get encourage to take some interest in the vir virtual project. <laughs> and it's good fun. Uh, good banter as well. Here they come. Uh, Airbus One Tango saying he's not going to need to stop on the runway. Yeah, Roger. Oh, the speed is coming in at that. <laughs> is this his first time? No, he's, he's flown the A330 before. Really? Oh, wow, well, that's... Uh... He did. He used it for the uh, the cargo tour that we're doing. Oh, of course. Well, can they get out of the way again tonight? Mm. I think if we can. Where about you flying? Uh, uh, when the next leg we're doing is I forget how to say it, but EDDP, Le Liege Pig or whatever it's called. Leaves like two happens. Yeah. Nice. Oh, he's no. I I don't know. I don't know what this. It's a very floaty oh, that. Is... Yeah, I've got him on tower view. Yeah. Oh, he's really slammed on his brakes. ATC message. Glasgow Towers just came online. Looks like he'd be that. And in, uh, no, correction, GMC Air, uh, uh, Airbus One Tango will be taxiing back to Sand One Bravo. Taxi to Sand One Bravo, uh, Roger. Uh, GMP Int. Go ahead. 
Oh, sorry, wrong one. Uh, uh, disregard. Uh, GMP Air. Go ahead. Yeah, uh, do we still need emergency services or is he good to go on his own? Uh, uh, stand by. And uh, Airbus One Tango is suspected fuel link, uh, fuel leak on the right wing. We're sending out for runway inspection now. Oh, right, right, right. So runway two four closed. Two four closed. Lampai King stream. <laughs> oh, here we go. <laughs> I can one aircraft ruin it for everybody else. <laughs> Airbus One Tango, Ember um, Ground, hello, I have emergency services on standby, are you able to taxi on your own or do you need assistance? Incoming chat message. We're able to taxi on our own, we've still got both engines uh, fully up and running, Airbus One Tango. Airbus One Tango, taxi stand 1 Bravo via Alpha and Echo. 1 Bravo, Alpha, Echo, Airbus One Tango. Well, I need to get Amy's comments on this. Amy, uh, bit of a... Was that a fuel leak we had in it or something like that? Or... Incoming chat message. Yeah, runway inspection yeah. is in progress. Amy, uh, there's a bit... I think there's a fuel been leaking on the runway by looks of it. How is it? Are you ha coping with that? Are you ha okay with that? Are you very angry? Are you a bit of rage? Is your tower heat a bit to blow its top? You know? <laughs> All these questions. It's really annoying having this runway closed. There's just so much traffic in these slams. Yeah, I know. Yeah. We're holding everyone up. Here. Absolutely. You see them all, all, all holding it tight and right now. It's gonna be a lot of refunds. <laughs> <laughs> Airbus One Tango, you can cancel your emergency. Squawk 2000. Squawk 2000, Airbus One Tango. Enter. Go ahead. Runway inspection complete. No fuel found on the runway. Uh, Mayday cancelled. Runway 24 back open. Roger 24 open. Mayday cancelled and nothing found. Thank you. playing within uh, Iba. Ah, absolutely. Yeah. Brings me back to my no pixel days. Ah. <laughs> I used to wake up at six o'clock in the morning just to join the queue to play on a 5M server with a bunch of Twitch streamers. <laughs> Harsh times. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then I just woke up one day. I was like, I'm bored of this. And then I never logged back on. I've got a character that's got like $4 million in the bank. So many yeah. supercars, nice ass little apartment, and I just don't play it anymore. I just got bored. Yeah, bet like Moochie T would be too much money, and that's it. So. <laughs> yeah. Airbus One Tango ground. Airbus One Tango, pass your message. Can you just confirm I've not passed the uh, one Bravo? Uh, all <laughs> I've got here is one Alpha, and then it ends. Um, uh, yeah, it's so the very last one on the left, uh, depending on your scenario, if you kind of get one Bravo, you can take one Alpha. Roger, 
Roger, we'll take one Alpha Airbus One Tango. Airbus One Tango, Roger. Hey, right, let's say uh, he's parking over one Alpha, so it's fine. Must be a seed or anything. Don't know. Glasgow is all staffed up as well now. Exactly. Yeah, then. Yeah, all staffed. Up. Was it, have they got a radar as well? Eh? No, 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 no right. That's alright. Just ground and tower. Ground and tower. Oh, who's that's up? like that's like that's like rare to see for Glasgow. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Okay. Uh, that is interesting. Well, we're nearly, nearly on the first hour. What up to go? Is so the Airbus heading back up? Um. Oh, he's disappeared. Logged off. Uh, so it's uh, that answer remains a mystery. To be honest. Fair enough. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, I wonder if a luck will hold to tonight or not, but I don't know. We've got one more hour left anyway, so... Uh, me and Airbus One Tango. Oh, he's still loaded on, okay. Airbus One Tango, Ember the Ground, pass your message. You can get in coordinates with uh, a mechanic just to give us a new fuel seal. Uh, Roger, that. I'll take care of that. And um, yeah, hopefully, you have plenty of fuel there. <laughs> we'll certainly to fill up Airbus One Tango. Roger, that. No problem at all. I hope it's going to be a lot of fuel this time. <laughs> right. So we're just doing more. We just. <laughs> yeah, so... And Airbus One Tango Tower, I'm correcting the ground. Sorry. <laughs> Go ahead. Uh, what's your intentions for your departure? Uh, Airbus One Tango, we're uh, good to go ahead and uh, attempt to get this fixed. We'll refuel the aircraft and we'll do a safety inspection on it. If all goes well and uh, everything's resolved, we'll go ahead and make way over to uh, Echo Golf, Papa, Foxtrot to do our touching goes over there, Airbus one time. And uh, for your departure, uh, is that an IFR or VFR that you need? Uh, we'll go ahead and take uh, IFR, Airbus one time. And uh, one last question, um, are you needing a said departure or non-said departure? Roger, I'll get back to you. I'll coordinate with uh, Weather. Roger, feel free to take your time. We're not moving for a while here, plus one tank. Roger. GMP Ent. Not accepted. I'm just kidding. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah we have our wonderful uh, Airbus Industries, one tango. He's wanting to depart on a non set departure to Glasgow. It's just terrific. I'll sort that out for you. Uh, Roger, thank you. Pretty sure you're GMC, not GMP. Yeah, I always I'm get this mixed up. Controller. Yeah, it's easy GMP for is, um, yeah. delivery, ground movement plan, and then your ground, move, ground, ground movement GMC. controller. GMC, yeah. yeah, that's right. It's easy to just say ground pro, uh, radars or whatever. GMC int. Go ahead. Um, is uh, can you just confirm he's heading over to Glasgow? Uh, confirmed. Uh, Roger, could you get him to switch his flight plan so his destination's to Glasgow? I will do that. Uh, stand by. Airbus One Tango. Pass your message. 
Yep, uh, can you just uh, refi your flight plan uh, to Glasgow on a VFR for me, uh, please? And we'll get you clearance through shortly. VFR? Correction, IFR. God, I'm getting mixed up there. Uh, Airbus One Tango, ground. Getting all flustered. That's a message? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Airbus One Tango, I don't know if that's going to be possible. I can't put two destinations through the flight plan. I'm looking to go do uh, touch and goes at Glasgow and then return back to uh, Edinburgh. Airbus One Tango, uh, stand by, I'll get that to you. GMC and. Good evening, how can I help? Uh, good evening, sir. Yes, yes. Um, so, there's Airbus Industries 1 Tango. He, his intention is that he's wanting to perform uh, IFR to Glasgow for, uh, for IFR circuits and return back to Edinburgh again. He's requesting that he's wanting to file Edinburgh to Edinburgh for this one. Okay, yeah, right. That, um, that's understood. I'll get you clearance shortly. Roger. Why does Caden make it awkward for me? <laughs> Why is someone calling me? It's probably at your tower. Climb that. <laughs> it's, it's, oh. <laughs> I told this guy to put your initials underscore observer and he's connected to Ivow as initials underscore observer. Silly boy. Notepad ready for this clearance for a <laughs> you still want to do the the cargo event tonight, or you want it tomorrow night? No, I want to get that flight done tonight. All right. No worries. Um, because the one afterwards, which I would have to do on Tuesday, is going to be the longest flight of the whole thing. I might be able to do it to that one tomorrow night, but I don't think we're going to be able to do that one together. Yeah, I don't want nah. to make you wait like. <laughs> no, we'll go and do it anyway. Another day. Then I'll probably call it night after that. So. Yeah, and then Airbus I'll probably. Airbus One Tango, Grand. Uh... Oh. oh, here we go. Airbus One Tango. Airbus Grand, pass the message. Yeah, Airbus One Tango, uh, could you go and place a hold on that uh, clearance right now? We're uh, having some flap issues. <laughs> Airbus uh, One Tango, Roger. Um, could very concerning with you tonight, but Roger that. <laughs> New aircraft is out the hangar. What do you expect nowadays? Should have flown Boeing. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Anyways, <laughs> I don't think the plane's a problem, Paul. I'll be honest. Yeah. Boeing's probably more worse. <laughs> <laughs> I've never had any of the yeah, problems that that's he has. True. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> Roger. Um, yeah, pilot. It's always pilot error. Yeah, blames the wings, blames the fuel, um, yeah. <laughs> blames the red button that keeps lighting up. Yeah. Or the big button that says "Do not push," and they push that. Yep. <laughs> uh, GMT in. Go ahead. A clearance for Airbus Entries 1 Tango. After departure, runway 24, route direct to Charlie Uniform Mike Bravo Oscar, climbing altitude 4,000 feet on Edinburgh QNH 1023, Squawk 0441. Right, so he's uh, after departure, runway 24, it's direct combo. I'm just. Uh, Charlie Uniform Mike Bravo Oscar. Not above altitude 4,000 feet. Embry QNH 1023, Squawk 0441. I just confirm that's climbing altitude 4,000 feet. Climbing altitude, standby. Yep, that's really back yeah. correct. That's it, got it. Airbus One Tango, just to uh, advise, I'll have your clearance for you when you're ready. Roger, 
Roger, just stand by one. I'm currently fighting with the flap switch to get it to work. Roger. Hello. Hello. You are? Ah, I'm very well, thank you. How are you? Oh, I can hit. Oh, are you streaming again? Yep, streaming again. Yep. Ah, uh, I thought I could. I just heard myself. It threw me off. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, doing a bit of streaming. We we'll have some problems with this uh, Airbus Industries one Tango flight. It's standing at one Bravo E as. Uh, oh, sorry, one Alpha now. He's just been having a lot of difficulties. Oh, really? Yeah, first of all, um, it's funny, like, I was saying this live on Twitch as well, like, uh, just when he was about to take off, and they were, we were discussing a bit that he, I bet he's got hardly fuel, then, maybe, what, half an hour in, we got a pan, 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 no fuel. <laughs> <laughs> nice. But now he's, now he's fighting with his flaps, so. Ah. Uh. Oh. <laughs> Incoming chat message. Oh, in. I'm doing a nice little flight down to Santorini. Yeah. Uh, oh, you uh, yeah, anyway. Yep, stop back. Yep. Airbus One Tango, pass your message. Roger Connor, thanks for thanks for Airbus being on today. Tango, we are ready for Please. that clearance to Glasgow for our touch and go. His flaps are finally working with us. Let's hope they stay that way. <laughs> Airbus One Tango, uh, whole position. Departure runway two four, direct combo, climbing altitude four thousand feet. Ember QNH 101, correction 1023, squat 0441. And Airbus One Tango, I hate to be a pain, but could you spell that waypoint for us? Airbus One Tango, uh, direct combo, it's Charlie, Uniform, Mike, Bravo, Oscar. Okay, so. Cleared to Glasgow via the runway 824. Direct combo, Charlie, Uniform, Mike, Bravo, Oscar. Climb 4,000 feet on Edinburgh's QNH 1023, squawk 0441. Airbus One Tango. Airbus One Tango, read back correct. Hey, got it. Fantastic. Um, Just quickly, Paul, is it the um, is it altitude you need to download for the um, pilot client? Uh, ye yes, that's correct. Altitude is called, yep. And um, see, so after you install it, it's going to pop up a web page. It's going to uh, recommend you to download the MTL. It's your model matching and just a couple of the critical files. And depending on your internet speed, if it's really fast, it should take about a, up to a good half hour just to fully install. And after that, you can start your flight somewhere up. Jesus. Yeah. Some people are logged in far too early and then they got error messages straight away. So, uh, so what kind of... Yeah. That's fine, I'll wait yeah. for it to install. Yeah. Nah, it'll be worth it in the end right enough. It's it's just all nice and sim simply easy because the software just does it all for you. And it's the same with the ATC client. It's uh, just all done for you as well. So it's... No business about trying to get a sector file, it's just, just, yeah. And just simply lo log in, if it finds an update, it just fires it straight in very, very quickly and it's done. We, do, we wouldn't even notice, so. <laughs> so. Uh, is it pilot call that I need to go on first? Uh, pilot call automatically start when you start flight simulator, but as long as it's installed and it's set to start automatically with flight simulator. How do I do the um, model matching thing? Um, the website will pop up once you once you've finished installing the pilot altitude. All oh, right, okay, so something's It'll, so yeah, that'll pop up next day. Do I need the? Oh, do I need to download MTL? Yeah. It's I a see. small. It's just a small software. You just download it and you just open the zip folder and just run the app. And then after that, just get it to detect your flight simulator and just click check the box that will highlight everything, all the aircraft set in its list. And just it would this affect my my one for bat sim? No, it'll be in a separate folder in your community folder. So 
say. But uh, on the other hand, uh, that with that sim you can add IVO um, model, Azure model match match into in a V pilot. So See. yeah, it's quite good. Oh, that is fast. You've got good internet. Yeah. Oh, I'll get about 10 minutes then. <laughs> you may or may not get a wee error about message at the end of that, so don't worry about it. It's, it'll be fine. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. Right. Let's book I'm doing on IVO tonight. Yeah. And that's a Santorini. Oh, that's a long flight. All right. Yeah. Well, that's where we're going on a uh, flight. Me and Brad are doing a flight from uh, a New Zealand to Athens. So we're, we'll, be, we'll probably be meeting you there. Nice. <laughs> oh, was uh, eight. Stores. Uh, oh, this is what I've done, Paul. If you look on the screen. Oh, I. Uh, so I've used oh. like the cookie as. Uh... Yeah. <laughs> oh, I love the seas. They're brilliant. <laughs> this is what I did for my one. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty smart. Oh, look at the bottom. We we cannot determine the same. <laughs> Is amazing. I know quite quick to be fair. Ah, it's gone quite quick. I had to wait an hour for mine. <laughs> I've, got, I've only got 60 meg, so it's, I was very. Oh, I've got yeah. a gig, so mine does probably go oh, quite quick. Oh, jealous. I feel jealous now. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Airbus one time going by ground passing message. Uh, I might have a long shot here, but do you happen to know the length of the runway? Uh, stand by, I'll just get the charts. <sighs> Anyone remember the length of the runway? Because I don't know off the top of my head just now. I'll have to get the charts. Uh, hold on, I'll grab it for you. Where's it, Edinburgh? Uh, yeah. Um, uh, the length of the runway. I think it was on the way. Is, yeah. is 2,558 meters. 2,558 meters. Airbus 1 Tango, the runway length is 2,558 meters. Or 8,392 feet. Roger, this might be a bit tight, but we'll, we might need to add heavy circles in here because we've approximately loaded oh. 111,000 kilos of fuel. 1.4 miles. Well, that might be enough to get to Singapore, so Roger that. We'll uh, call you Airbus <laughs> 1 Tango Heavy. <laughs> I'm recording that now. <laughs> he's, fully, he's, he's really tanked it up now, so... He's not going to be able to take off then. Huh? He, I don't think he's going to be able to take off then. Not that much fuel. Yeah, no, and I don't know if it's a good idea to perform touch and goes like Glasgow <laughs> if he's heavy. So. Are you at Glasgow or are you at Edinburgh? Uh, we're at Glasgow. <clears throat> oh. No, we're at Edinburgh. Oh, you're fine. You're fine. You got Edinburgh to yeah, Anthony's there you, on your flight plan. No, are you are you thingy in? Are you you're controlling Edinburgh, now, aren't you? Yeah, <clears throat> me and Brad are both on Edinburgh. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, that's fine. Yeah. No. That's fine. That's all I need to know. Yeah. <clears throat> no, I'll, I'll get there. I'll get I wonder if Ken will actually make his flight uh, with it. Oh no, he doesn't get back until half past, doesn't he? Yeah, uh, or the wire will. Half past eight, I think. I'll take Jet 2 holidays or Jet 2. Hmm. Jet 3. It's probably holidays. Yeah, I'll go for it. Take Jet 2 holidays, why not? 
I am observing on your frequency. Yes, she has been very, very observant today, and uh, I think, witnessing I, all I, this I, traffic. I think she, I think she stopped talking to us because uh, we had, we thought we had uh, fuel spilled on the runway, but uh, I can, can't confirm that never happened. So that's okay. So we don't need to have that report reported but uh, we may have an incident shortly we may have a plane that might not lift off from the <laughs> hit somebody's hoose. yeah he's gonna have to pay attention to his v1 speed mm. i don't think he's gonna get up i genuinely think his v1 will be like a taxiway brother yeah <laughs> <laughs> Or at least like more than halfway down the runway, if he's fully fueled. Yeah, that's dumb. I don't know if he wants to take uh, take the Charlie one for departure. Yeah. I'm going to cut so it's for dinner whilst um, this sorts itself out. So you're back into my mentors. Roger, we'll will keep an eye out for you. That internet speed is crazy fast. I can't believe that's nearly halfway done already. Oh yeah, I got the uh, the Hawk T1 as well. Oh, lovely! It's really nice, and it's pretty it's pretty simple to um, start up and stuff. But it's uh, not as easy to control as I was expecting it was. I tried doing a bloody loop, and I ended up in a in a lake or in a little river. So you know, I cancelled my slot so I can catch up with my tours. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, I think it'll be me, you, and Caden uh, tonight then. Oh, lovely. Um, me and Paul are doing a flight to Athens in about forty-five minutes. If you are. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I started the uh, Scottish VFR tour as well. My next flight is uh, Inverness to Wit. So lovely. I'll need to ask Amy if we can get her on Inverness. And I can get on Wick. Yeah. Hope for the best. Hey, boss, one tango ground. Hey, boss, one tango. Pass the message. Airbus One Tango, we are fully loaded with 111,000 kilos worth of fuel. Request an engine start, uh, stand 1 Alpha QNH 1023 on board. Airbus One Tango, your engine start is approved. Do you require pushback as well? Sorry, could you repeat that, Airbus One Tango? Would you also require pushback? Uh, Airbus One Tango, let's just hold on the pushback. I want to make sure that the fuel actually stays in the wing this time. <laughs> Roger, your startup was approved. Call for push. Call for push, start approved, Airbus One Tango. Uh, Paul, what it is, I'll send you these. Um... Yeah. I think you can't add me as a thing to your channel where I can edit the panels, but I don't know how you do it. I know there's a way to do it. Um, I think it's add editor. Let me have a quick look here. I think I might know how to do it. I might, I'm not too sure. Uh, I'll, I'll have a wee gander at this. There you go. I've just found a little guide, I think, that I've had open before. Where are you? There you are. I need to find someone who's decent with uh, liveries as well. It was one tango, pass message. Uh, Airbus One Tango, just confirm 4000 is going to be our final cruise now. Uh, altitude or are we going higher for uh, Airbus One Tango? <clears throat> um, 
Airbus One Tango uh, Air Beret is offline, so it's going to be at your discretion, Unicorn. Roger. Nearly there. And the Airbus one time, I can safely say that the fuel is staying in the wing request and uh, engine pushback. Why is he moving forward? <laughs> Airbus one tango, your push is a put, it's a straight push onto stand one zero zero. Straight push stand one zero zero, uh, Airbus one tango. Who is the Airbus One Tango? It sounds a familiar voice. Caden. Oh, okay. GMC Air. Uh... Oh, I've got a call. One tower. Oh. Get out. Uh, GMC Air, just to let you know, Vueling 8, uh, correction, Vueling 7815 is a text pilot. Roger for that one. Yeah, thank you. Hey, uh, bye bye. Love you, bye. <laughs> ignored me on Discord, so I thought I'd just call you in, in Aurora instead. Oh, right. Oh, sorry, I was, uh, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, Paul, do you know anyone that's good with their liveries? You know my Hello. little um, British Airways, um, little British Airways Piper Arrow livery. I want to put a little badger on it, but I don't know how to edit like a livery that all that I've already got, or whatever I'd have to. Oh, and there was my Tangle Red Taxi holding point Delta One. I want to put like a little badger and my call sign under the uh, thingy. Yeah, bus one Tango Taxi holding point Delta One runway two four V Echo and Alpha Q and H one zero two three. Echo Alpha Delta 1, QNH 1024, Airbus 1 Tango. I want to put a little badger under the window, put my call sign on it. Yeah, I wonder if they... I, 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 I wanted to make you one as well and make you one with your Pilo Whiskey Whiskey Charlie on it. Oh, lovely. Yes. That would, that would be Instead really Instead of uh, Golf Hicker Golf Sierra X3. That's a bit of a shit call sign. I don't know how if I, I don't know if I'd have to like make it as an entirely new livery, or if I can just edit one that I've already got and just slap a badger on it. Uh, to write rules. Okay, how to do that? Ah, rules manager. Uh, ah, okay, okay. So I'm gonna go here. Go here. Pull. Static? You get static? Yeah, just ever so slightly. Ooh. I'm not too sure why. Oh, it's gone now. Ah. Seen to miss it probably. Ah, I found it, Rolls Manager. A. Hey, mm. you Search. What's your. What's your. What's your Twitch handle? Ross. Ross can fly planes. Uh, anyway, just a bit, just for, uh, just for a wee bit of a cheeky say, can you text it to my DM and I'll copy and paste yeah, it? Yeah, of course. Yeah, sure. Just in case I send it to somebody else, you know. <laughs> oh, Paul, it's quite funny. Last night I was trying to, um, I was, I was looking on YouTube to like set up my uh, Airbus side, uh, my Airbus Thrustmaster throttle thingy for like for, for like GA aircraft. Ah. Look, I bring up the first video I find on YouTube, and I'm like, oh, this guy sounds familiar. And I look at the name of the channel. It's fucking Rory. Oh. <laughs> 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 I was like, this guy sounds very familiar. Yeah, it was him. Yes, it does, are you? Uh, Ross, that's the edit editing role being switched on for you. Oh, so it says completed with an error. 
So just, it's fine, yeah? That's fine, yeah. Um, always get the one silly one, but it's... Every damn what do I need to do now? Yeah. Um, you can just start with your Microsoft Flight Simulator. Well, that's it. Yep. And then it'll kick in the core. And then once once you're spawned in, you can start the pilot client. And right. so there's going to be just a one-off login for your VID and passwords. After that, it just automatically logs you in every time you start it. Yeah. So you're on ground or you're on tower? Or you're on ground? Uh, I'm on ground. Oh, I see the viewing coming in now. Yeah. Yeah, text pilot, so. Yes, he's not set. He's logged in as a voice pilot for some reason, so I don't know why he's. Where, where, do, you, where do you see that? I, um, I still... yeah, it would be on the right side. It'll have a, it'll have a mic and an X next to it. So, um. What, on the... on his on, on, right next to viewing, so um, okay. but because not there, he's, he's logged in as a voice voice pilot. So. Well, maybe he's just typing text but receiving voice. I don't know. Yeah. Hey, boss one tango. You can contact Ember Tower on one eight decimal seven zero five. Safe flying. One one eight seven zero five. We might be talking to you shortly, boss one tango. Oh. <laughs> The lights on. Message on primary. Message on primary. Get him stand one night. Let's see. This could be a rejected takeoff. No, I'm waiting right. for it. I've got, I've got the tower view. Are you flying, Caden? Yeah. Mm -hmm. he's Caden. Let me go watch yeah. his. Let me go watch his screen quickly. He's literally in a fully, a fully fueled uh, A330. He's moving very slowly. <laughs> Speeding up a little bit. Rotate. He's... Where's the squat mod, well, I Charlie? Got <laughs> I just got a load of errors um, on my flight sim load from Let's have a look at your core or something. Oh, you need to restart mm. your computer. Sorry, I forgot to tell you that. Um, ah! Yeah. That's fine. Really yeah. quickly. Yeah. That's fine. Let me take Yeah. I hope, I hope the error message doesn't come back. If it does, we'll have to reinstall and restart again. I'm sorry, but it, uh, but it can still pop up with the error messages for um, in the meantime. For That's fine, I'll restart quickly. Yeah, no way. Season. Season. Hello. Hello. Hello, how are you getting on? It's good to have the terminal on with us. And I can't believe Kevin actually took off. Yeah. He sounded very panicked though when I when I handed him off the unicorn. Yeah. It did look very slow on tower view. <laughs> uh, 
we've got left, we've got half an hour. Right. It's not been busy tonight, Terminal. It's a bit of a disappointment. It's not been busy. Yeah. I find Saturday evenings and Sunday lunchtime, that's where it's busiest. Yeah, maybe we should do it earlier next week, Paul. Uh, well, oh, Sunday, I mean, like, last... Sundays are a bit of a problem. Uh, for me. Last last week was really busy, and we didn't have mm -hmm. radar. And then this week we had radar for about forty five minutes, and we got one plane. I'm making a huge just a little bit. You got scenery for the uh, the flight tonight, Paul? Um, Leipzig and Athens. I'll check my uh, folders to see. Just use um, Volanta. Volanta tells you what airports you've got custom scenery at. Oh, you get a little yeah. gold star on them. Keep getting that, yeah. I have got scenery for both of them, and they're very nice. The uh, the 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 Lee's big one, uh, Le Leipzig one, has like a massive DHL terminal that takes up like half the airport. Hello, I'm back. Oh, welcome back. It looks really good. Fingers, See if it loads. Yeah, fingers crossed it'll load straight away without any issues. Ross, are you any good with liveries or, or have you not done that before? Uh, I've never done it before. Okay. Paul, do you know anyone? I know Blue. Blue. I just blue. I literally just want a little a little like cartoon badger on the side of my plane and my my, my badger call sign. Should be able to do it. But I don't know if it like I, I would do it myself with Photoshop, but I just don't know if it has to be like done as an entirely new livery or if I can just stick a badger over you the can top stick of on it. already done. Because I want to keep the same livery because it's like a nice like British Airways livery on a Piper. Looks really funny. I'd say yeah. message blue. You got his Discord. Uh, he should be yeah. in here. I think he's in here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stream, see what he says. My um, core hasn't loaded. That's that's okay. It will shortly. Um, oh, okay, cool. Yeah. Is it open with like FSU RPC or something? Yeah, that's no, right. Uh, just... Oh, yeah, that's right. It works. It works with it if if you. It, yeah. If that if, if that yeah, kicks yeah. in, that kicks in after yet. So we'll just. What's that? Me. Is what's that web eye thing? Is that is it called web eye to see? Yeah, web eye. Yeah. You can actually oh, log man. into it as well and set it's set up to your preference, and you can even click on uh, your friends on it. Basically. Quite a lot of flights yeah. on IFA though. I didn't realize there was that many. Uh, it's it's not bad. I think it, other countries are busier than. Uh, really it's quite bizarre, yeah. So like in that sim, like I think like countries like South America are quiet, but in Ivo it's busy as hell. So it's a bit of a funny mixture right now. So. Oh yeah, you can freely customize it, can't you? Yeah. And if you, I don't like say for example, if you click on one of our towers or even one of the planes, you can click on plus next to our name and then we become, we become your friend on it and uh, and you can identify your planes quicker with but what colour would you set as set as friends yeah, yeah. So, yeah. yeah if the core hasn't opened up already I would just open it up just open up core and then open up client that's what I normally do yeah because mine don't open up automatically I, I think I think it already has yeah it's oh, yeah, it has, yeah. yeah 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 so it is, yeah, I mean, haven't had any errors yet so no that's it it's oh. running there so yeah I was I was hoping when the FS seven came up, if an error message came up straight away, then we were not knack at it. So, but no, it's worked. So I'm very happy. I 
I just thought the next flight simulator game would load quicker than this, so... <laughs> I've added just a friend who let me do it. Ah, if you click it, then leave it like 10, 15 seconds and it'll update. I should have mentioned that before, but yeah. That's... I assume you can get um, Aura on Mac then, if it's this. Yes. Yeah, but it's a bit buggy. It, yeah. Oh, it's it's not, I don't want to do it when you use it on Mac anyway, so. Yeah. Yeah, Emma had that experience right enough, and uh, I don't know. She got she got it working, but they, she's broke us in an extra eight on it as well, which is causing problems. So, and, oh, really? and it, it's the settings are just it's just a little different from the one we use right enough. It's it was becoming a pain. So her, she was better using it a barely workable old Windows 10 laptop. So <laughs> and it's. Done a lot better. Yeah, no, fair enough. Yeah, she's really looking for getting her, uh, getting her PC very soon, like so. Yeah, no, I spoke to her earlier about it. She was um, seemed quite quite excited for it. So, she's planned her first flight, and it's going to be Edinburgh to Alicante. Nice. Just take your brother to life, man. Yeah. So. Be Miss my departure slot. Uh, we'll love this slide. The same here for <laughs> No, he's um, I have VDGS up, so it'll come up to minus. Oh, Barbie, is it any good? <laughs> yeah, it's all right actually. I've yeah, I've started watching it. It's all right. Yeah. But I've got um all the live TV stuff as well. So yesterday I was around girlfriends watching the boxing. So. I used to use that, but I've got something else now on my fire stick, but that's bullshit. Oh, I will not I will not go any into any more detail. <laughs> yeah, well, she just messaged me. Oh, the old firm match is on. HD in a second, there you go. Give it a second to buffer now. Just buddy pulls the next him. Take his time a bit. Yeah, it does. Do you know what? So obviously, I've just added new things into it and stuff. So, hey, fantastic. Says offline currently. I gotta wait for me to come on and ask. Yeah, 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 yeah. But you can get everything all set up in the meantime. So you get your mic, push the talk key. Oh, why is it not press... detected? Are you using a joystick? So, yeah. Oh, you need that. Um, need a third party up for that. Uh, oh wait, support. don't connect. You've you've spawned in. Pretty oh, he's much. oh, he's on the text list. I, yeah. It hasn't, I probably haven't, it's probably just my, oh yeah, I have. Oh, right. Yeah, that's fine. Spawning in, spawning in on a runway is a big no-no for uh, either. Oh, oh shut GSX. up, I didn't oh, do it on purpose, did I? <laughs> no, no, I didn't realise you had GSX, that's fine. <laughs> uh, 
Um, yeah, you'll need a program called Joystick Key, and then you'd have to bind your uh, your your button on your joystick for it. Um, as far as I know, it's free. Mine was, I don't remember paying for it because I only used it for yeah, uh, get five the, It's a demo one that I ended up paying for mine in the end as well because I thought yeah. that it was bloody useful and it got my uh, push to talk key working on my. Oh, yeah, it's uh, free. You can use it after trial for after trial for continue usage. Please consider. Oh, you can use it. I've, free. I've had it as I've had it as a as a trial demo for like two years. All right. Really? Oh, well, really? I'll, I'll, I'll come up contributing a couple of quid for it, so it's fine. Right, so how do I connect to this then? So uh, offline, put in your call sign. You got? A... Yeah. Oh fuck's sake! Yeah, hold on. Uh, what's my call sign? Channex eight seven on your hotel. Actually, that's it then. That's it? Yeah. Yep, get it. Perfect, it's a flight plan oh. already, yeah? Yep. Good yeah, the thing good to thing know is, is, when, you... is um, when, when you come in, just check that it defaults your squawk to 2000. If it doesn't, then it's not connected properly. You'll have to restart the pilot core and the pilot client. Um, but the, the, the sign that it's launched correctly is that you're, uni you're on Unicom and you're squawking 2000. Right, so what do I do? Else, All right, okay. Press so, the press the button you want to use as your push the top button on your joystick. I am. Um, hold it and see so you find find it light up on your thing. It hasn't lit up. Uh. Try on joystick two. What 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 uh, joystick are you using? So no, I've got foot pedals. Oh yeah, you'll have to go in there and. Uh, I have an idea. There's a there is an app for the um foot pedal. Foot switch. I'll just change it in here. Paul, that, that viewing is set up for a return flight now, but just memory's text only, so Where keep an eye that? on the chat book. Oh, that's I didn't have. Uh, right. How do I see what eight people are on? Uh, where do I? It's normally better. Oh, shit. Is there a way to, easy way to get on? There's no notes bit either, is there? This is so much different. I play good with a belt and team speaker as well. Someone tried to contact. Oh, there is a view link. Right, okay. Uh, should, uh, should, uh, uh, let's start with a view link. Joy to key opened up and I'll see where the setting is because I don't know there's something you have to do for Magic Games will do play your flight plan a little bit to say this. Need to free farm on? Uh, yeah. Oh, there you do that. Uh, yeah, I got, need to go, go into an AOA for the Talus X Charlie departure. So, two seconds, I'll sort that out for you. Uh, da, 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 
do. Oh, on Joy to Key, there's a preference highlight pressed buttons. Um, yeah. And then you know what button you're looking for. That's the one, yeah. And then you just sort of click it, and then it will say, like, for me, it's button two on my joystick, which I have set to right control for push to talk. And I might have just said that on frequency several times. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta pick. You just gotta just gotta give you a wee ping alert, so uh, don't panic. I think you can use the tower departure because it says Go route oh, by wow, Yankee nine six or leaving controlled airspace via tower, which is what he's doing. Yankee 96, I because uh, because you're a jet, you need Yankee 96 on your airway. Yeah, but yeah, but it, yeah, but it says all leaving controlled airspace via Tala VOR, which she's doing. Let me double check that. Because is that not at a certain time? Uh, between uh, jet aircraft November five seven. Hang on. Uh, got he's on... <laughs> oh wait, sorry. Jet aircraft November. I thought because his, his is November nine seven. Yeah. November so, nine five seven uh, between the hours of twenty three and six hundred. So that's overnight. Yeah. Is it leaving controlled airspace? No, he's uh, he's still in the controlled airspace. So basically, yeah, he's flying to. There's a difference leaving... between airspace that is not being controlled and uncontrolled yeah. as in class g airspace yeah you're on you're in you're if in you're leaving wing. tala into class g then that is uncontrolled but if you're leaving into class a or class d then it's not it confuses me i've i've always, I've, I've never uh, had anybody tell me i can't yeah. use that, uh, that, sure that part, yeah. so t most talas should get go some unless they're on specific routes okay specific okay. airways Where is Go Sam? Oh, that's all the way over there. Right, the Talar departure is only available to non-jet aircraft. Jet aircrafts may use the set if routing via Yankee 96, leaving CAS at Talar, or routing November 57, Lima 162, November 864, between 1100 to 600 in our local time. So in this case, I need to put you on uh, on course to airway Yankee 96, which is the we represent you. So, I was reading the job. <laughs> I, I was reading the wrong thing. Yeah. No, it's fine. No, it's it's all part of my exam as well. I need to know these things. But uh, but that was that was good. So. I have sometimes, and it's it's always fun. Yeah. So this is been late. I would I would I would. I would Oh, I see. Okay, on the I, on the quick view, it's worded slightly differently. Did it? Oh, on the quick, yeah. On the quick on the, on the quick view, it says or leaving controlled airspace via Tala. Yeah, I looked that's at that before. That's but on, weird. But on yeah. the proceed on the main procedure, it says you can use a SID if routing via nine, Yankee nine six leaving. Oh, I don't bloody know. 
Yeah, so you can you can use Tala for a jet aircraft that's leaving controlled airspace at Tala. But there's not many jet aircraft that will be not climbing into controlled airspace. I see. I think it's, yeah, I think it's just a routing for it, really. So, uh, yeah. But it's done the same thing that, yeah. that I do, just let Simbrief. I just normally click the top one on Simbrief. <laughs> yeah, that's the problem with Simbrief, because it, it does do that. Yeah. Oh, we've got two inbounds coming in. Both very close to each oh, other. Oh, wait a minute, Matrina. Well, uh, tell me, I forgot you here, so uh, I, I think it was right to give the Teller the Yankee 96 departure yet. If, if it was Yankee 96 yeah. to somewhere, then yeah, yeah. probably. Yeah, I see, yeah, it's in the, in the procedures, I Yeah, otherwise. Yeah, that's just that's just the only said that's a bit of a bother, but apart from that, the rest of them are great. It's but Teller, uh, jet aircraft, Teller uh, then, yeah, it would next, Yankee 96, and then. If it's props, then yeah, I can, I'll let them off. <sighs> I've never controlled them, but after 11 o'clock yet at night, so. But I do know on a night shift, be easy, I can clear everyone any, regardless of the flight plan. But yeah, you can go, you can go, you can go. Even copy and paste that into your um, Ivo flight plan. Uh, Sonic 87 Romeo, so uh, Edinburgh ground radio check. Sonic 87 Romeo Hotel, Edinburgh grounds, good evening, visibility 5. Oh, you Thank got you, you've got 555 also. Got golf on board, Boeing 738. Stand 15, clearance please, Santorini. Shot is 87 Romeo Hotel, information golf is current. You are clear to your destination. Tala, uh, 6 Charlie departure, squawk. Stand by. You can squawk 0324. Clear to Santorini, Tala 6, Charlie Departure, runway 24, Squirrel 0324, Shanix 87, Romeo Hotel. Shanix 87, Romeo Hotel, Yuri back is correct. Message on primary. Lovely. Three across of the departure now. It's looking good. It's picking up in the last ten minutes. Yeah. Well, we've no, that's fine. We've just got to extend the next for 15 minutes out of uh, yeah, that's fine. I'm happy to stay on for a bit. Yeah. I've got plenty of time to do that. Yeah. I'll go run. It's typical I have to get busy now, right at the end of the session. <laughs> Always away, innit? Yeah. This cabin one's looking quite busy tonight. Ten members already in there. Yeah. I'm sure Ames got control of things. <laughs> Ground, good evening, Foxtro Bravo, 835, then 18320, radio check. Foxtro Bravo, 835, Ember Grounds, good evening, visibility 5. Five on five, all the view, Fox from Bravo X ray five five. Somebody sent me a, a data link. 
Okay. Yeah, don't, don't Online for but that, that guy's cool. Galaxy 87 Romeo Hotel Stand 1 5 ready for push and stop. Business jet on this website, but I don't think that's going to be it. Shadow 87 Romeo Hotel from Stand 1 5. Uh, push and start is approved. Uh, are you able to face uh, Western Lima? Hey, fan, fast up uh, Western Lima, Shadow 87 Romeo Hotel. This is an easy jet livery. I just got caught by easy 4146, but I don't see him anywhere. Easy 4146, I don't even see him on the radar. Uh, he's trying to contact me if there's CP DLC, I don't know why. Is it the guy at stand one? Because he's in an easy jet livery. Yeah, not him. Uh... Oh, uh, no. Easy for 146 Emperor Ground, are you on frequency? Guess not. Fox Hot Bravo X ray 55, are you trying to get clearance through text? Yes, Fox Hot Bravo X ray 55. Fox, uh, Fox Bravo X for five five. It's come through as call saying the easy uh, one for correct for one four six. Are you able to update that on your uh, flight management computer and call back again with that? Yes, sorry, uh, Fox Bravo X for five five. Swiss 5426, hello. Swiss 5426, Ember Grounds, welcome to Ember. You can take stand number 8, Taxi, Alpha, Echo and Foxtrot. Alpha, Echo and Foxtrot, stand number 8. Yeah, I was going to say, Paul, he's got an easy jet livery. I'm, not, I'm looking on tower view, but I don't know what, what his call sign is. Uh, Fox on Bravo X ray 55. That's not one yet. Uh, I'm not so sure why.
Something's wrong with my mouse. Um, face me the wrong fine, way. Fine, 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 <laughs> <laughs> it just said Fox Rock Brother X Ray Five Five from Stan. That was Montego Roger. Push start is approved. Uh, facing north. Push start approved. Facing north. Fox Brother X Ray Five Five. Oh, here he comes. No, he's going around. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> <laughs> well, Paul, I can only apologize, they sent me the wrong way. Oh, did you face the wrong way? That's okay, I can get it in, it's no problem. <laughs> it's just as you said that, I just put, yeah. I panned my camera down and I just see you turning, facing, like, away from the room. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, you did want to see what's behind you. <laughs> no, I did, I no, saw, I did see it. <laughs> uh, you already missed a... Yeah. Oh, we got another one. Wait, we got... Someone has just spawned in on the same stand as somebody else is pushing. That's me. perfect timing as well. Tomjet2290, perfect timing when, uh, <laughs> when he did that, so... Why is it getting busy now? So Fox what's Law. this guy's call sign? FBX, just yeah, Fox Fox Bravo X-ray. Yeah. Right, just literally as it is, yeah. Okay. I value is very weird, I'll be honest. <laughs> I'm trying to get my head around it still. Yeah. Well, welcome to the family. <coughs> it's in intriguing. Bit more chill, bit more chill here. Yeah, well, there you go. I know we're getting traffic, this is crazy. Hayden said the reason for his go around, he said he was unhappy with his position and he's way too heavy. He says he's like a hundred and something like. Shannon's 87 right now. Hotel. I believe you're facing east, is that correct? Hey, facing east, Shannon's 87 Romeo Hotel. Shannon's 87 Romeo Hotel. What we'll do is we'll get you to taxi Holdy Point Delta 1 Romeo 2 for. Veer, Mike, Quebec, yes, Papa, primary. and Alpha. QNH1023. Delta 1, Romeo 245, Mike, Quebec, Papa, Alpha, QNH1023, Shannon's 87, Romeo Hotel. Oh, I'm pretty sure he could make that turn. Just left at the end. I could of make that. You could I could make the left here. Alright. Yeah. Shannon's 87, Romeo Hotel. Can you make a tight left turn onto Mike? Okay, we can take the left onto Mike, Shannon's 87, Romeo Hotel. Shannon's 87 Romeo Hotel, Roger, you can taxi Lieber, Mike, Alpha, and hold Delta 1. Lieber, Mike, Alpha, Delta, hold Delta 1, Shannon's 87 Romeo Hotel. Lovely. Uh, we've got 146. Fox Rock Bravo, X-ray 55, uh, ready for taxi. Fox Rock Bravo, X-ray 55, taxi, holding point, say, Delta 3 via Echo. And Alpha, QNH 1023. Delta 3 running to four by Echo, Bravo X-ray 55. So you get there first? Yeah, it's alright. I can always hold You can have it first, there. I don't care. Yeah. <laughs> I want it. I ain't a race. I don't want it. Just... <laughs> no, I'm just. Through <laughs> the, the fucking yeah. idiot. Everyone free cut the grass. Beautiful sunset. Sun yeah. Yeah. Uh, 
Oh no, you'll be there miles first. Yeah. yeah. Hey, me? Yeah. yeah. Obviously, if you sing, I'm easy. I'm a. Guys, change the Q&A. Sorry, it's changed. Oh, Delta One, Gen X eight seven, Romeo Hotel. Something? Okay, it's just, uh, what could you say? Did you get before one zero two three? Yeah. All right, okay, stand by. All stations, ever broadcast. If Mission Hotel now current, you Q&A one zero two four. If Mission Hotel ever out. There we go. Q. Check, 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 packs on. Uh, Tom Jet 2290, but Edinburgh round. Uh, I don't want behind the landing A330 on a five mile final. Uh, Vi, don't want that, Romy 24 behind. Chenix 87, Romy Hotel. Foxtop Bravo X ray 55, contact Edinburgh Tower on 118 decimal 705. I'm testing the teleport for Rally 355. Totally got some nice wind on the way down. Tomjet 2290, post message. Tomjet 2290 to ground uh, request uh, for clearance to. Uh, wait a minute, please. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's got where he's going. <laughs> oh, we're seeing that again. Is that, is that our friendly neighborhood That's the... Airbus? One tangle. He's coming. <laughs> Here he is. Tomjet 290 request for clearance to Mandela International Airport. You could have got me out in that, Brad. Tomjet oh, 290. Uh, can you confirm your aircraft type and stand number, please? Uh, Roger. 73780 and stand, uh, stand one. Tomjet 290. Tomjet 22980, Roger, if Mission Hotel is current, you are clear to your destination. Go some one Charlie departure, <coughs> spot 0302. Tomjet 290, clear to my destination, as filed uh, out of runway 24 via Goza 1 Charlie, uh, squawk 0302, Tomjet 290. Tomjet 22980, read back correct. If Kaden goes around, he will do that to one. Yeah. Let me tell him to hurry up, bottom. Yeah, no, he's holding up traffic. Unbelievable. Too far yeah, on the right, the wrong way there.
Hi, Nikos. Yeah, how you doing, by the way? It's uh, good to see you. Yep. Yeah. Oh, this is a long stream. It's been two hours. But like, thanks for thanks for that. Yeah, it's been good. Yes, it's on primary. It's feeling on the move. Ready for push and start. Tomjet 2290, push and start is approved, facing north. Push and start approved, facing north, Tomjet 2290. <laughs> Airbus 1 Tango in the ground, good evening. Approaching Bravo Alpha 1 Zero, request parking and stand 1 Alpha. Airbus 1 Tango, hold short Alpha 1 2. Hold Alpha 1 2, Airbus 1 Tango. Nikos, that was a long, long day in church, by the way. You've uh, been there all day long. That must have been a hell of a good session. So, get the tunies out. Did the... Uh, the Slash from Guns N' Roses actually turn up? That must have been a good show. Right, so Tom Jets away, get the airbus in. We'll close up. I was <laughs> Nico. I was slapping that bass as so yeah. Or I was slapping that bass so I'm not too sure exactly how that word's been spelt, but yeah. You rocked it in church today. Yeah. Forgot to put me um autopilot on. <laughs> Oops. So I, I rapidly descended, and I, I literally I put my headphones off, and I was terrain, terrain, <laughs> pull up. <laughs> I recovered it though. Yeah, good recovery there. That's a. Uh, did you just want to reassure the passengers that you're that, that they're safe? Yeah. <laughs> oh, they know they're fine. Oh, very nice. Vodka on the hus. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> You'd be lucky from Jet Yeah. <laughs> Day. It is, I'm trying to wonder, yeah, what cargo flight, yeah, we'll definitely do that. Yeah. Right, I'll see if we pick it up. I'm just going to do a closing broadcast. All stations, all stations, Ember Ground and Ember Tower will be closing in five minutes.
Airbus One Tango ground. Airbus One Tango, pass the message. Can we swap to stand 7 if possible? Airbus One Tango, Roger. Uh, proceed ahead after Alpha 1 4, make a right onto Foxtrot for stand 7. Roger, continue Alpha after Alpha 1 4. Uh, right onto Fox Rock for stand 7, uh, Airbus One Tango. He's got enough fuel, he can make it. <laughs> I hope so. Yeah, <laughs> getting the long way around. It's just case Tom Jet wants to go. Uh, Paul, you see uh, Tom Jet's uh, waypoint is Go Sam 1 Charlie 2 4. Yeah. Change it to G5. It's his intention code. G5? Yeah. It's uh, if they're leaving, if they're entering the Shannon FIR via Rotev, it's uh, G5. Tom Jet, do the next I know there's no Senate for Travelers on, but it's a yeah. good habit to get into. Got it. Tom Jet 2290, you can taxi holding point Gulf 1, runway 24, via Echo and Alpha QNH 1024. Mm. I couldn't figure out what the Shanex one was because it's not. Taxi to holding uh, point, holding point to Delta One via Echo and Alpha QNH One Zero. Not GM. Yeah. I wonder if. Oh, I thought it was crashed. Who? I thought it just crashed. Oh, you? Yeah. <laughs> I thought I ate it. I thought, oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, Brad, what, just do a contact me message, just take these planes off me. Uh, don't put me reconnecting. Oh, your Aurora's crashed? Yeah, my Aurora's crashed, yeah. Okay. Uh, yes, uh, let me hop into your creep and see. Let me just. It's actioning. Yes. Yeah. Just getting shouted at for logging in for like two minutes uh, for just coming back yeah. and wait half, wait half an hour. No time for that, no point. Where, where <laughs> did you get with him? You just he, taxi yeah, up to Delta taxi One. Yeah, taxi Delta One, yeah. And a uh, Airbus is going to stand seven. Roger. Uh, and PM. GPH ground. Uh, it's definitely come back to life, that's for sure. Oh well. Try to bet doing this to cargo to uh, cargo tour on tonight. I'm up at five in the morning, so I'm debating. <laughs> I mean, we would be down before like eleven. Yeah, no, I'm up at five. Yeah. Though. Oh, I see. Yeah. Well, I might, I might just do it. Uh, well, I could do it with uh, with Caden. Yeah. Because obviously, you'll probably have time to do one tomorrow, where I I, I won't, and I've got the uh, the big one, the the Athens to thingy. Yeah, I'll try and do it. I'll try and do it tomorrow after work. I'll have to be tomorrow night at some point. And uh, yeah, see what happens. Actually, we'll try and get, we'll try and get them in. Yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll try and get two flights going. Get one there. Yeah, I'll try and do two flights tomorrow after six o'clock. As long as about yeah, oh, damn it, tight, my time's gonna be tight for me. Um, good luck. I get one flight done tomorrow. That's, well, one flight definitely. Two flights. Well, I'm proficient. Uh, enjoys a work up at five in the morning on a weekday. That's it. Uh, there we go. 
Well, I don't think we'll wrap this up, guys. I don't think we'll end the stream here since my software's crashed. And uh, uh, any final words from everybody? Okay, then. Lovely. Hello. Thank you. Um, <laughs> 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 Thank you, Nikos. Uh, good night to you as well. Thanks for the chat messages. So, um, and thank you to Amy for observing in and checking in. And thank you to the followers that we've had. So, that's Nikos, Raven, Brad, Tristan, SW Controller. And it's been a fantastic day. So, uh, oh, also, I forgot two else we get. Uh, we've got Ross and Simulation as well, who's followed today as well. So, thank you very much for that. So, That'll be me setting off for tonight, and we'll be back again with more exciting flying or ATC. We'll see what comes next. Probably going to be a flight, so we'll catch you next time. Thank you. Have a good evening. Bye-bye. <laughs>